Welcome guys uh, to Motorfit Adam channel. Today we're gonna discuss about cornering and also we're gonna talk about sitting position on the bike. So uh, you know it's really important topic. The boat is like a combination. Like if you wanna sit on the bike, there, there are some rules that you need to be, obey the rules. And also uh, while you are cornering your body positions should also be changed you need to do something more you know uh, so let's talk about these topics and now i'm gonna describe you how you're gonna sit on the bike while you are cornering or while you are using safely to your bikes you know uh, firstly handlebars is really important how you're gonna uh, you're gonna hold it it's really important for handlebars some people are using the bike like this it's like you're gonna kill the bike you know you, you, you are like forcing the handlebars if you are holding like this the the handlebars which you are like really applying so much pressure on the handlebars uh, the, the bike the front wheel is not gonna turn so easily you know uh, it's not really easy to turn it but if you are really relaxed using it really relaxed and bending your your spine uh, like this this is the shuttle and also this is the clutch clutch lever so if your wrist and hand is like parallel to this and if you are using it really relaxed the handlebar moves easily you know if, if there is some danger on the road like a rock or something like a hole you know if you are using like this you can easily rotate it you know but if you are using like a hardcore pressure the handlebar you are not gonna able to do anything about it so you know uh, just use it like this all the time uh, holding the handlebars all the time like in a relaxed way so that you can easily rotate the bike and also uh, you need to put some gap uh, between the fuel, fuel tank and yourself like a fist gap like because it's, uh, it's makes you feel much more safer if you are uh, putting a gap in between your hand and the fuel tank is, you know your spine can easily uh, you can use the handlebars easily and you can bend your spine uh, so much better this way so guys this is the body positioning on the bike while you are driving safely let's talk about cornering body position Okay guys, uh, to the cornering to left, you know, uh, there are some rules before we corner to the left side, you know, uh, always obey these rules and don't forget about them. You know, the sitting position is really critical for cornering to the left side of the bike. You know, uh, while we are cornering, we need to sit like this. Now I'm gonna show it to you guys. You know, uh, get on the bike and kick the side stand okay like this and also while we are cornering eyes on the corner you know do not look if you are turning left do not look to the right side because you can crash something you know to the rocks you know uh, whatever you are thinking about you know don't look at the right if you are turning to the left you know uh, if the corner is go going to left hand side you know uh, you just need to corner you just need to look with your eyes and also the body position should be like this as i told you before uh, you know hold the handlebar like really relaxing way and uh, bend your spine a little bit and also this is your knee you know uh, your knee should be like if you are turning late you, you just need to you know there are some pegs over here you can put your foot to the peg like this uh, but don't forget about braking on the corners if there is something dangerous is coming up you just need to brake with your rear tire you know with your rear tire so always put your right right foot to, to the braking pedal so don't forget about that you guys okay so if you are turning to the left if you are cornering to the left always put your foot uh, on the peg and uh, just Bend your knees slightly, okay? Guys, uh, just hold the handlebar like this, you know, very relaxing way. And uh, bend your spine a little bit 
on front and hold it like this so if we are turning to the left side of the you know left cornering very sharp left cornering uh, you know the seating position is changing a little bit like this you know okay hold the handlebar like this relaxing way and put your put your knee on the pegs on the left peg okay so while I am cornering to the left my eyes is always look in the corner you know just don't you know if you are cornering to the left don't look at the right right side of your eye because uh, you know if you if your brain is mixed you can just crush the bike on you know something on the right hand side so guys always when you are cornering don't take your eyes from the road always follow the road and always keep your eyes on the road of your cornering so while I'm cornering on the left my knee you know I'm holding the bike like you know uh, from the left and the right positions so while I'm, while I'm cornering to the left my legs is I'm just you know flexing on the left a little bit like this you know just flexing a little bit like like this way you know so it's really important to relax your you know flex your leg like this way so okay guys don't forget about this rule always eyes on the corner and your leg bend your leg a little bit if you are turning left or right bend it like this and also you know you need to drop your shoulder a little bit uh, while you are turning to the left drop your shoulder three things you know three rules drop your shoulder uh, eyes on front for the left cornering eyes on the left and also your knee a little bit flexing your knee to the left you know but if you are like a MotoGP driver or you know very nice super sport bike driver uh, you know don't forget about these rules and also while you are cornering to the left they always touch this wrist on the road that super sport guys you know MotoGP guys uh, driving on the skill performance road they always put their wrist on the road they are using the plastic sliders you know on their wrist and on their uh, leg they got plastic sliders so if they are turning to the left you know they are using that left sliders look about the cornering and right now i'm gonna tell you something more about body positioning which i'm gonna give you really quite an important stuff to you guys very important very crucial and very critical things for the body positioning you know uh, the, the, the thing that I'm gonna express you right now is you know on the body position uh, you need to be so relaxed and freely moving on the bike you know uh, like 360 degrees you need to be ready for left left cornering right cornering left sharp corners right sharp corners so you need to be freely moving on the bike like this you know freely moving on the bike so so guys like if you guys are gonna take a really late sharp turn you know don't forget take off your bum a little bit from the seat like this you know this is like a moto gp guys is always doing like this you know take it a little bit far you know and also uh, you can just uh, pull yourself to the tank like this you know and take off your bum a little bit and when you are turning left eyes on the road you know uh, holding the handlebar really relaxed position and your knee is a bit flexing on the bike you know to the to the left when you are turning so like this you guys shoulders a bit down legs is flexed and the bum and the butt is is out of the seat you know so this is like a MotoGP guys are doing and also you guys also need to learn these techniques which is really important very crucial and okay guys now we're gonna make some corners twisty roads uh, so the, the important thing over here is like how we're gonna position our bike on the cornering like which part is going which which way and which part we're gonna act like this you know 
this is really important for you guys. I'm not a teacher, I'm not a supervisor, you know. I'm not like giving a, a, academical things for the body positioning or cornering. This is just my knowledge, my information. This uh, this like uh, what I do so far in my bike, what I'm using. And I would like to inform you guys that this is the reason why I'm putting these videos. So don't take it really seriously. But if you are really, if you are really agreeing with my channel with my videos please thumbs up please subscribe it you know and thanks for watching me guys and now we are hitting the road okay guys now we're gonna talk about uh, how to position the bike on the twisty road curvy road you know while we are cornering uh, while we are cornering the, the real important stuff is you know when we corner on the right hand side of the road or left hand side but uh, on the further right hand side or on the further left hand side of the road there are some little dirt particles or some stones little bit stones on the road so we need to be careful with them you know so now guys i'm gonna i'm gonna show you guys how to make money subscribe to my channel and also for the following videos please uh, follow them as well and thumbs up for this video thank you guys thank you guys for watching me thank you for watching metal fit adam channel thank you <laughs>